Prowler. Oh, wow! Welcome to Aliens Fireteam Elite, a third-person survival shooter set in the Alien universe. All right, character creation, new marine registration, UAS Endeavor, United American Colonial Marines, Terra Celestis Incognita. So let's see what we have here. We have feminine or masculine. Then we have faces, different type of faces. Okay, presets. So it doesn't let you go too much into detail, but that's fine. It gives you some options. Then it has different skin color here. Very nice. And um, then different eye colors. Okay. And then, oh, hairstyles as well. Oh, the good old marine one. There's loads of short hairstyles as well. I, I like it. And then we have different hair colors we can apply. Very nice. And voices. <laughs> Anytime, anywhere. Run at a bypass. Notch up another kill. All right, this is the closest I could get for myself. So let's go. My parents were scientists. They taught me biology is war. To win, a species must endure, reproduce, survive. The foes we're about to face evolved to win at all costs. They don't care about their losses, so long as they're the last ones standing. They're as cunning, adaptable, and tenacious as any Marine. But they lack our purpose, our conscience, and our mercy. 40th Marine Expeditionary Unit. This fight is not a simple bug hunt. Know our enemy. Know your strengths. Work together and live to fight another day. Colonel Ship, signing off. Shake the cryo-freeze off, Marine. We got woke by a distress call. A Dr. Tim Hanukkah sent a mayday from an orbital refinery. Situation ain't clear, but on the outer rim, there's always a chance of xenomorphs. Board the station, find Hanukkah, and extract them. Staff Sergeant Herrera will be the voice in your ear. She'll guide you, warn you of enemy movements, and provide support. Might want to talk to Herrera before you deploy. Okay, who's that? Oh, here we go. Hey, we didn't get a chance to brief earlier. Short version, while you're on the tip of the spear, I'll be in the dropship with El Tico running Overwatch and eating my abuela's cookies. You listen to what I say, I'll get your ass out in the smallest possible number of pieces. And you can have a cookie. You got any questions? Now's the time. So, sorry, yeah, about the cookies. Um, is it only one? <laughs> you don't deploy with us. Uh, what kind of ship is this? No questions, I'm ready to go. Well? Hell no, I'll be in the platoon tack ops center running shit by remote. Better me than some butter bark on my mierda fresh out of OCS, huh? Usually I'm in a drop ship on Overwatch. When we ain't got air superiority, I'm dirt sight in an APC. When things have really gone to shit, I'll be in a foxhole brushing dirt off a laptop with one hand and shooting with the other. Point is, I run ranged sensors and tech support for you. For anything I can't handle, I call Esther. Our battalion synthetic, an android. She's a medical corpsman, science advisor, electronic warfare tech, and MFLC. That's a military and family life counselor. Fancy way to say she listens if you got issues. <laughs> That's awesome. While we're in the freezers for long trips, Esther and Endeavor's mother computer keep the ship running. She doesn't normally deploy, but we get her on the radio to solve problems. Did the Penejos at the Recruit Depot that? give you any briefing? Or they just kick your ass into cryo and call it a day. The Endeavor's a Tianxin class assault ship, cutting edge of the United America's fleet. Built at Puelches Station, commissioned in 2194. Remember the old Conestoga attack transports from the 70s? Well, we're about three times the size. More self sufficient, more amenities, bigger guns. I like it. No more questions. You and me both. Let's do this. So this is our campaign selection. We only have one campaign available, but the loadout screen, that looks like a lot of fun. I've been just looking around a little bit to get myself familiar with it. This game seems to be much more in depth than I thought. So each of those four classes obviously have different purposes. The gunner is your standard assault rifle, everything the demolisher, um, has perks like micro rockets, blast wave, a smart gun, a secondary instead of a shotgun. The technician also shotgun a secondary, but then a standard magnum, but it can he can put a turret down charged coils 
So different type of abilities. And then the dock, of course, also is an impulse rifle and a magnum as a secondary instead of a shotgun. And it has abilities like trauma station, combat stems. But while they all have that, you also can completely modify this. So you have your weapon where you can put different type of mods on apparently. So that's pretty nifty. And then you have paint, different paint jobs. Okay, oh, look at that, nice. Oh, wow, this is awesome. I like that. And we have decals here, here. Oh, the Endeavor, I love it. Or oh, the fire. Oh, that is pretty cool, I like that. Can we move the, oh, we can move the decal. That is so awesome. All right, having played around with that a little bit, um, we also can change the abilities. So if we click on them, we can modify or enhance our abilities. That is amazing. So you can see you have here different perks um, where you can increase your stability or your magazine capacity. Then you have focus fire perks, gunners only, um, different type of perks, but they all seem to fit only into certain slots. So I'm assuming for demolition and all that, the perks are gonna be different, modifiers. Yeah, absolutely. So they all have their own little perk tree. That is so cool. And then what do we have here? Consumables. Well, we don't have any consumables available right now. And then we have appearances. Yeah, this is where you basically can choose what you want to look like. I put bandana on here just to play around with it, for example. But I think for my solo attempt, I'm gonna go with technician so I can put down turrets and stuff because I'm assuming it's like having a second pair of hands on top of the AIs. In, in case the AIs are not very good, I have no idea. Oh, we have an inventory here as well. So we can, okay, we probably can find different weapons possibly. Attachments, consumables. Okay, so here's just everything. Challenge cards. Oh, okay. Challenge cards, no idea what they are yet. Challenge cards can be used to modify how missions play in unique ways. Completing missions with a challenge card grants additional rewards. Earn cards by completing tactical opportunities or obtain them from SSGT Park. Okay. And then here we have our team. Oh, look at that. There's other people playing it. Awesome. Look at that. That's nice. All right, enough shenanigans on this. We have our load out. I'm happy with the technician. Let's go. Priority one. Fire team. This is a rescue mission. Difficulty standard. Um, challenge cards enabled, but we don't have any, I guess. And much ma making public. Can I just do private, avoid the public queue and play only with your current fire team? So what happens if I play by myself? Can I do that? Launch mission. You're gonna stay on standard. Confirm. Okay, here we have the mission count on loadout kits. Technician. Yeah, we're staying with the technician. We don't have any consumables right now. And um, that's the only one. So I don't know what's gonna happen if we um, don't invite anybody, if we're gonna play this by ourselves. Um, if we get AI, I think we get AI. I have no idea. We'll see. Oh, look at that. We seem to have some AI with us. They look dead as night. They look actually like the synth. <laughs> we got a ping on Dr. Honecker's personal data transmitter. Okay. He's not far in. So with Q, we can First, set a turret. First, we need a deck plan. Pull one okay. off a terminal and chlorine extraction. Just looking at my abilities again, my turret, uh, obviously it's a turret that deploys and fires at enemies and can be picked up and redeployed. Charged coils, a uh, tosser device that launches itself onto your target and unleashes direct electrical shocks in the area, damaging enemies and reducing their movement speed. Cross-platform synergy, allies standing near your turret take 10% less damage. When you stand near your turret, it regenerates 5% of your HP every second. That's amazing. And then I have another perk here, technical perk. Okay, that's because I'm a technician, so I get access to the sentry turret and the charged coil. That is pretty awesome. And then we have other hotkeys here. What is C? Oh, it's a radial menu. We don't have anything active here. And then what is four? Health already full. So that is like calling for a heal or something or healing up. And then three. Okay, so that's like a little pistol. And then with one, two, and three, we change weapons. Okay. So this little pistol here seems to be infinite ammo kind of type deal. Meanwhile, the main weapons have limited ammunition. Okay. Okay, let's go. Huh, just emergency lights. And maybe we can kick the backup power after we grab Honaker. What could go wrong? Oh, look at that. Oh, wow. <laughs> I was only messing. I didn't think he actually was killable. I thought he was just like some stationary object. Wow, okay, fair enough. Download refinery plants. Oh, what is this? Oh. 
Hello? Patch into the console. I'll pull it down over wireless. I love this. This actually looks literally like the same rooms that you had in Alien Isolation. That is amazing. I, I love that they're thematically stuck exactly to it. That's brilliant. Okay, let's patch in. Give me a second. I got a deck plan. Backup generator is beyond Hanukkah's ping. We can kick it after we grab him. All right, let's go. Our men should be in the junction ahead. Honaker, this is the Colonial Marines. You hearing me? Oh, this is not good. We're not getting a response. Oh, Acid wow. Damage. Not encouraging. Continue your sweep. Oh, there's something on the radar. Something over here. Maybe it's one of the survivors. He should be right here. Oh, what is this? High speed incoming. Whoa! Get Don't lock up. Way more than I expected. Okay, my turret. Oh, I love my turret. This is so fucked. There we go, nice. Watch the ceiling. I didn't expect so many. Oh, you knew about this? Hanukkah's PDT chip. Cut it out. Oh, look, we can but heal our why? comrades. Nice. Oh, I love the way it goes into my backpack. That is nice. Okay, let's go. Ah. Doors welded shut. Sloppy work. Guess Hanukkah went this way. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. We got incoming. Oh, he was a red bastard. Oh, my God. Like, he looked like he was hardcore. Okay, do, do I have heals? I don't think I have heals. How can I heal? Can I heal you? Let me see if I touch you. Stop it. Stand still. We'll fix that up for you. Oh, now I don't have a health kit. I thought it was something we can use over and over. What a waste. What a waste. Maybe we get a new one. Unidentified Zeno. Headshots always work. It's a friendly fire. No, okay. Hey, I got an idea how to track down Honaker. Searching okay. this whole barge would take too long. Rearming. Movement. Tell you my idea later. Very nice. Oh, look at that. We can take cover and everything. Okay, here we go. Oh, nice. Oh, crap. Well, we have limited refills here, it seems. Shooting from cover, nice. Oh, there's more coming from here. Well, my turret should be taking care of most of them coming from over here. Oh, crap. 
We have to be careful not to walk through spits. Oh, wow. There we go, gotcha. The exits are sealed by Honaker, probably. Release the locks. Okay, come back to me. There we go. Oh, we have a 12 second cooldown because I didn't pick up a, pick it up. I actually just destroyed my turret. Okay, so let's go full on refill on the ammunition as Grabbing well. Ammo. Nice. Okay. Do we have to go for each weapon individual refill? No. Okay, I'm on max on everything. Okay. What do we have to do? We have to go behind us? We have to... Oh, we probably have to interact with the panel or something. Yeah, completely missed that. There we go. Anyway, I'm thinking we can track the doctor using station logs. Okay. I found a data access point, but it's further in. Concentrate on getting the power up. Is there any more coming from here? No, looks clear. Okay, let's pick up the turret. was intense he jumped me right in the face okay okay let's go let's go let's go let's keep pushing forward I have a feeling they will just come and keep coming more and more let's go dynamo rooms just ahead restarts mostly automated Okay, we got incoming. Hear that? Oh, I can see you. Ooh, okay. Some more coming from here. Okay, why don't we put the turret down here? Spinning this up is gonna make noise, vibration, heat, whatever bugs key off, they'll catch it. Alright, let's do it. Be ready for a fight when you switch on. Okay, we have our turret here. This thing's been idle a long while. It's gonna take time to movement. Shock. There we go. Slows them down. Very nice. Oh, wow, 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 don't stand in the spit. Oh, we have a Xenomorph Buster. Yeah, we need the big gun. Dynamo just finished injecting lubricant. Oh, they destroyed my turret. Okay, maybe we need... Um, Right here on the entrance. Something to slow them down. H2 feeds just connected. Getting there. Nice, slowing them down. Okay, let's put a turret here. Big damn signal here. Okay, let's reload. Get the health kit. Oh no! Just about to kick power to the mains. Oh, did I die? Wow! Oh, got it. Nice. Okay, this is bad.
Put the grenades down to slow them down. Follow up engineering team to get that mess fixed proper. Whoa. Keep heading aft toward the core. Those bastards for this. Okay, self heal. Okay, let's go refill an ammunition. Whatever this is, open crate. Consumable. Oh, okay. Sentry gun. Oh, we got a spare sentry gun. Oh, right. So we can have two sentry guns now open. Very nice. I like it. And we can't pick that one up, though. So it was a bit of a waste. Okay. At least we know now how it works. Guys. Let's make sure we have our hand grenades ready. Got another swarm brewing. Break out the heavy shit. This is gonna get spicy. We have a turret. There we go, nice. Oh, nice! I have a dodge! Bypassing death. <laughs> nice! Awesome! I didn't know we had a dodge! Bypassing death. Come on, you. Gotcha. <laughs> nice. The okay. data access I mentioned is just ahead. We'll see if Honaker's left any tracks. Is there any more coming? I got Esther standing by to analyze the logs. She's our battalion synthetic. Hello, Marines. It is a pleasure to work with you. Well, let's go. Just in case. That was a bit premature. I panicked. Ah! Oh, nice. See, you have like quick time events as well. Coming from here. Okay. Anybody from here? No, they all seem to be coming from here. Oh, we have to go back? What did we miss? We went the wrong direction, probably. The access point is to the right, through the door. I'm so low on health. Okay, let's go. Let's buy this. Come on, protect me, guys. I don't want to die. Can somebody heal me? Can you guys heal me? Entry 
Gun ready. Okay, just in case. Okay, let's pick it up. Okay, let's do- Oh! Sentry's ready to go. There we go. Let's do this. Accessing. Thank you. I You're will welcome. Be a moment. <laughs> that would be a moment. Just a moment. I need healing. Runs through the logs, so you keep heading out. I got you, beta. Oh, now we have to go back. Oh, wow. Okay, let me get my turret. Okay, we got this. Where do I have to go? Where do I have to go? Let's pick up my turret. And bring it up here. So where do we have to go? Oh, there's something over there. Something green. Oh, what the hell? Okay, I'm nearly dead, guys. <laughs> nearly dead. Okay, I think we have to go here, yes. Oh, pick up my turret. Pardon me. Two weeks ago, the mainframe on Deck 41 was accessed, I believe by Dr. Honecker. Okay. Grabbing ammo. Marines, head to the core lift. Big freight elevator goes all the okay. way up the main tower. Okay, let's go. When we reach Honaker, we're gonna have to ID by his blood or by his teeth. I, I got a pool running. Whoa, wow. This looks absolutely amazing. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Main access. <laughs> Somebody actually paid for safety rails. <laughs> got some big internal leaks. Never a good sign in space. They would be coming from here. Oh wow, they're coming from all the way over there. Nice. Nearly there. You still good, Marines? Yeah, I'm fine, absolutely. We don't find this guy alive. I'm gonna kill him. Okay, so he's dead either way. That's the lift. Entrance on the far side. Oh, we got incoming, we got incoming. Same deal as the generator. Expect little friends to pop out all over when this turns on. Okay, let's do it. Let's pick up the healing. Let's use it on myself. It'll take a while to show. Oh, nice. Oh, what is this? Set up a perimeter, then hit the call button. 
Oh, we got an extra sentry gun. I love it. Incendiary rounds. Oh, baby. Let me see if I can use them in... Oh, actually, I want to use them in my pistol, I guess. Oh, well, eight shots is eight shots. Yeah, okay, let's do that. Okay, where's the noise machine? Let's turn it on. Okay, extra sentry gun. Come. This is a big damn signal. Sentry deployed. Incendiary uh, ammo. Oh, I love how they are on fire. It's so awesome. Okay, they're not coming from behind us, but that's a good backup anyway. Okay, when I reload, will my incendiary um, ammunition be gone? Let me see. I think so. Okay, they're still coming only from the front. Very good. Attention left. Got a big, big guy coming from there. There we go. Nice. Yes. Oh, I don't like these guys. Center column, not a spitter. Where's the spitter? Don't step into the spit. Okay, we got some action from behind, but this turret is covering it. Right flank in the duct. Okay, we're getting we're coming in from the right. Something big and scary. Yes, it's down. Holy crap, Apple. Okay, they're coming from behind us as well, but this turret has it on the control, I think. Okay, we're nearly there. Ten more seconds. Oh, come on, baby. Oh, wow, 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 wow. Into the elevator. Hold on, Marines. Um, okay, where's the elevator? Oh, it's behind us. Let's go. Let's leave it all behind. Oh, this is so tight. This is... Oh, where's the elevator? Oh, it's there. It's actually right here behind us. Oh, my God. I can't believe I went around it. Come on. We're in. Were we in? Enjoy the ride, Marie. Yes. Next oh, my God. Or we made corpse, it. Whatever. All right. Let's see rewards. Mission completed. Submachine gun. Oh, okay. A muzzle break. Rep script. Whatever that is for. A requisition. Okay. And experience. Oh, okay. We got good experience. We didn't level up yet, but we leveled up our our weapons, which is awesome. Performance. I only did I did the least amount of kills. Oh my god, I got outperformed. Oh no, there we go. Headshot kills. There we go. Very nice. Um, yeah, the least kills though, but most damage dealt. Um, shot accuracy was awful. And that's our mission. Is somewhere Return to up base. on Katunga's mainframe decks. Looks like he's been searching for a safe place to hide from all the Xenos aboard. Our okay, mission hasn't changed. Base. Find him, get him out alive. So we're back at the base now and we have all these different characters. It says that we're still on mission priority one rescue. Oh, look at this. I love this. This looks so exactly like the game. It gives me such great alien vibes. All right. Here's a speech. Pay attention. 
I'm in the middle of six annoying things, and neither of us want you to become number seven. When you boarded, you got four basic field kits. Solid armad equipment, no frills, enough to do your job. You got setups for rifle, heavy weps, tech, and medical. Okay. Based on the missions you complete, you get assigned requisition credits. You come to me, ask for the equipment, and if you got the credits, I fabricate it for you. Awesome. You can requisition new weapons, or attachment for weapons, or consumables. Special ammunition, sentry guns, mines, whatever. I let Marines pick their own gear. You deploy with the wrong shit, you're the one who bites it, not me. <laughs> Talk to your fire team. Work out who's doing what. That's awesome. How about recreational gear? You're in the field, boot. When you get back to port, hit the commissary or exchange. <laughs> That's my official answer. Between you, me, and the bulkhead, I also got a special inventory. Stuff to personalize your gear. I don't take requisition credits for that. We got an unofficial system. Anybody ask, just say you tactically acquired it. <laughs> Items from perks, special stock purchase are using rap scripts. Okay. Well, I'm here. Let me see the requisitions. Let me see your special stock. Oh, yeah. What's so your special stock? So long as your rap's good, I think we can come to an arrangement. Yeah, let's have a look. I have nothing. <laughs> I have 50. I earned 50 in the last mission, I think. So you can get different outfits. Um, head accessories. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Glasses. Actually, that's pretty cool. I love that. All the different headgear. And then colorways. What is that? Oh, that's different um, colors for the guns. That is awesome. Obviously, different decals. Spray and pray. Bad call. I love it. Emotes. Well, I don't really use emotes, I guess, like, but in multiplayer, it's always nice to have them for a bit of fun. Mission card pack three. Ooh, for 150. Okay. Let me see what Yo, your normal stock is. I, anything not on the racks, I can pull out of cargo for. Oh, 4,800. Wow. So it's different guns, and then, oh, a rapid responder, handgun, riot gun, automatic fire. I love it. So we can basically get different guns, and then we use them and upgrade them. That is pretty awesome. I love it. I'm assuming gray means I can't actually use it? Maybe. I don't know. And we have attachments. Okay, they're 1,400 each. And perk kits. Oh, wow. So this is the different uh, perks. You know, these things that look like puzzles. That you have put in that um, perk upgrade screen. And then consumables. A sentry gun is only 200. Hardened electric shock sentry gun. So can I use all these sentry guns upgrades actually without having a sentry gun? Because I might try a different class then as well and just uh, use that as a secondary. There's another icon up here. Let's see what that is all about. Oh. I'm Ibrahim Savani, Colonial Marines Intelligence, Surveillance and Recon Service. Yes, most Marines call us Kamisars. No, we're not as bad as you've heard. Katanga has over 80 years of history, but the interesting bit is from 25 years ago. Its owner, Sikh Sun Company, reported oh, the refinery some. was destroyed. Yet, here it floats, in a system controlled by Sikh Sun's rival, Wayland Yutani. <laughs> ah, what does commissary do? We compile information on threats to the United Americas and provide it to the Corps to act on. Our sources range from battlefield recon to cyber warfare. Some believe we have spies everywhere, but that's simply not true. If everyone worked for us, who would we spy on? <laughs> <laughs> that, that, that was a joke. <laughs> we, we joke sometimes. <laughs> I'm not familiar with Sixen. No, not at all. No. In the previous century, they were a moderately large interstellar corporation. They even had aspirations of competing with Wayland Yutani. Sixen invested heavily in space facilities. In 2174, they purchased Katanga from its previous owner. The refinery was refit and towed to the mid -brim. Who was Katanga previously? Katanga was originally constructed 82 years ago by Kinshasa Enterprise Diatat Minier, the state mining enterprise of the DR Congo. In 2070, Kinetat fell under sanction by the United America's Assembly. They had sold resources to the revolutionary forces during the Haiti's revolts. To survive the financial losses, they auctioned off their space assets. That's when Sixon purchased Katanga. How was Katanga supposedly destroyed? Unclear. The ICC logged that Sikhs and scuttled it due to irreparable damage. There are no details on the cause or scope of that damage. 
you'd expect insurers to demand that. I'm That's following up with Central. If we learn something you need to know, you'll be informed. Well, thank you very much. Let's see who else we can talk to. Carry on. Oh, okay. She's not a chatty person. So if we look at the campaign again, we actually can see now we have mission two unlocked. So we need 150 combat rating. Yeah, we have 155. So we did obviously get a little bit up after the first mission, but this is really good. I'm going to leave this here though. Um, for this episode, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys had a good time with it. And if you did, remember to kick that like button in the balls. And I hope I see you guys in the next video. And if you're new to the channel and you like what you see, hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys next time. Until then, as always, feel spaß and happy gaming.